was the son of a pizza man, the only boy who could ever Hey guys, welcome to Son of the Pizza Man. I'm Enzo, and today we're making grilled pizza. So I've never made grilled pizza up to this point. So uh, actually I made a grilled pizza a couple days ago as kind of like a trial run to kind of see what it was all about. So this is attempt number two, and I think I've learned a couple things from my first round. So hopefully this one will turn out even better. So um, I just got back from starting the grill and that was challenging to say the least. But uh, we are now ready to uh, open the dough and top it. I'm gonna use very simple uh, toppings, sauce, cheese, maybe some basil at the end, but that's about it. I don't wanna get too crazy with the toppings. So my dough is ready. It's nice and pillowy and risen. So it's been sitting out for over an hour now. So I'm going to flour my surface get one of these guys off. Oop. The dough is super, super soft, which is lovely. Stretchy, it's always awesome. So the, for my first attempt, um, it, it turned out really well. Uh, the things that did not turn out well was that um, it was a little burned. So I think I left it on too long. I also didn't put olive oil on it, like when I flipped it around. So we're essentially going to cook the dough, just the dough first on one side and flip it over and then grill it and then put the toppings on it and then let it cook the rest of the way. So I just need to not grill it for as long, I think, and we should be okay. So I have my pizza peel, gonna stick this guy on the peel. And then uh, I'm gonna get this on the grill. Here we go. Okay, so the grill is up to 600, which might be too high, I don't know, but I can't, we can't really control the temperature of the grill, or I don't know necessarily how to do that, but we're gonna work with it. And we have our pizza dough. So, uh, before I put the dough on the grill, I'm going to pan it, so I'm gonna oil it to help with the, the sticking. Get some flare ups. All right. Here we go. Okay, so I'm also going to uh, I'm also going to brush the this side with some olive oil just to help it not stick as much. So we're gonna cover that up. Like so back. we'll so we'll wait like two or three minutes and come back and it's definitely very hot. Yeah, and check on the pizza. So we don't want it to burn. Okay. Alright, so it's been about two between two or three minutes and I can smell. Look at that. Whoa. That bubblage. So I'm gonna flip this guy over. Yeah, look at that. It's not bad. No, it's great. So, some Armuti uh, jarred sauce, which is delicious. It's hot. And then I have some um, just fresh mozzarella. I'm gonna kind of break up. All right, I smell burning. I do too. It doesn't smell like it's... No. It smells like it's burned. Yeah. Right. So... <laughs> it's too hot, maybe. So... 
there. Yep, it so it's already burning. Okay. All right, well. Can you put the lid on this marker for a second? I mean, I could. So it's been like 20 or 30 seconds. Yeah. Yes, yeah, it's burning. Well, all right. Yeah, I can really smell it. Um, and it looks cool. It looks cool, but. So I think it's about, I think it's about like controlling the temperature and making sure that. Yeah. I don't know. I, I mean, we have another. We have another pizza. Okay. Attempt number two. First attempt was too hot. Uh, burn the bottom. So we're just gonna try to work quicker uh, because we can't really control the temperature. It's about at about 600 right now. So um, yeah, let's just try to get through this. It's like a speed, like a like a race. All right, ready? Grill for a second. And put some oil on it. That's what the oil made it. Made yeah, it maybe. Burn fast too. Just like, because it definitely got like, as soon as you flipped it, there was like flames came up. So we're going to cover this for, let's do like a minute. And uh, yeah. All right, so it's been about 30 ish seconds. And we're puffed up. So that was a lot less than last time. Flip it, that's a little better. And uh, the sauce on here. It's like Pizza Olympics over here. Put the cheese on. <laughs> go real fast. <laughs> yeah. go, 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 go. Cover it, so we'll wait like Maybe like a minute. Let's just see where it's at. Okay. It's been about a minute. It's still like. Still no, it's just it's still like. It's better, but it doesn't it doesn't seem like cooked. So maybe it's just. You're taking out direct heat. Taking out direct heat. Um, so maybe, I think next time I might maybe put the coals like maybe like around the, like the perimeter of the grill. That way it gets, it's, it gets like indirect heat like in the middle so it doesn't cook so fast. I think maybe the olive oil could, have, could be a factor in it too. So, all right, so it's been about 20 seconds. I'm just afraid, I don't want it to be like, doughy, you know? It, to me, it didn't look like it was doughy. But I don't know. I don't know either. So it's getting dark, so I'm just gonna pull it. I'll just see what happens. All right, so let's go inside and taste these guys. All right, so we are back inside after our two pizza attempts. Um, I think the second one was a little more successful um, because we didn't burn it as much. Mm -hmm. I think the second one is a little burned, but not as much. So let's let's try the first one. The first one. So this is the first one, and. The bottom of it is like it's like pretty, super pretty burn. Super burn. Yeah. But where it's not burned is this like really pretty like caramel color that's great. Yeah. Oh, it's sweaty, sweaty Betty right now. Yeah. That's how I like them. Yeah. All right. Sweaty and Sicilian. Mm -hmm. There you go. Thank you. Ooh. Okay, so it looks like it's cooked through. Yeah. I feel like it's cooked through, but let's, let's try it. Okay. I don't mind it. Um, it so bad. Yeah. I really love the way the the, bubbles the dough like bubbles on the on the on the top side, and you flip it over, and then you have these like little little like, canyons basically, and um, little pockets on the underside. Which is really cool. So it's like, so it's like a, 
It's like a flatbread. Yeah. Kind of, so. Um, yeah, this is fun. All right, let's try the second attempt, which was less burnt. So I feel like it's probably gonna taste the same as the first attempt. I like sauce. I do like sauce, but damn. Okay. So, it's yeah, it's still, yeah, it's still a little burned, but all right. I mean, besides being crispier, which it's because it's hotter and fresher. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's also cooked through. It's cooked through, there's a lot more air in it. All right. Grilling pizza is fun. Um, it, it, uh, it's a little bit of work. Um, it's a, it's, I think the biggest challenge is the the temperature of the grill because you have to like control it, either control the temperature or control the your pizza. I was like, I was like zipping through the the, the second one. Yeah. And it still got a little burnt. So I feel like it might just be too hot. Yeah. So I don't know. Maybe something that's like kind of a little bit somewhere like a sweet spot of slow and low. Maybe something closer to like 450. Yeah. And not, or like even five. No. Oh. So if you uh, if you have experience grilling pizza, I would love to know your your tips and tricks uh, in the comments below. Uh, just let me know, and uh, I would love to have a conversation with you uh, because I would love to do more of these and and be able to not not feel like I'm gonna burn them every time. Um, I'm not discouraged, but, you know, I'm definitely going to do this again. I just, you know, need to maybe do some research and ask some people some questions. So, yeah. Well. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. So, that's barbecue pizza. Um, or not. Grilled pizza. Grilled pizza. pizza. Not barbecue not pizza. Not barbecue. Barbecue pizza would be awesome. Like, like a barbecue chicken pizza on the grill. Yeah. Yes. Get that, get that, get those flavors. Yes. As always, thank you guys for watching. And if you haven't already, please remember to subscribe. If you like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up. And until next time, <laughs> ciao <laughs> for now. See you later. That's how I feel right now. Big, big bucket of. Bye. The only one who could ever need me was the son of a pizza man. The only boy.